Hello, everyone. I am Gander of the gaming clan, Vato Clan, and I'm casting an in-house game that was put together by David12596. Uh, this is ten members of the, uh, or ten people that are in the uh, Dominate Dominion chat channel on the North America server. And uh, we, got, we got two teams here. Uh, top team, left team, blue team, whatever team you want to call it. Uh, we got Fat Me playing as Diana, uh, Netherrealm Man playing as Vi, Super Quack Duck playing as Poppy, uh, David12596 playing as Elise, and Painkiller playing as Sona. I'm one half of your casters. Casting with me is... Hey, I'm uh, KaroC21, and today um, I'm casting with Gander. And on the purple side, we have um, Alpha Ferric on Pulsefire Israel, uh, Silver Dragon23 on Riven, uh, Infeed on Bola Bear. Nightwolf Neo on Rise, and Evan Sue on Sivir. And we completely missed the bands because, well, I had to rebuy X-Split right mm -hmm. while everyone was in the lobby. And I didn't Indeed. remember my address or my credit card info, so I had to look literally everything up, and it was really slow. So we ended up with these champions because some things were banned, and that's how we got here. Uh, I'm gonna expect who are you, who do you think we're in? Let's see, David, at least bottom is at least bottom a thing. Uh, yeah, I, I believe um, at least bottom is actually a pretty good pick nowadays. I mean, at least has a bunch of like um, a lot of like pushing potential for uh, spire blowing up thinking, and a lot of poke with her Q stuff. since it, it actually comes from a percentage of their health, and she's actually at least is actually gonna be against uh, Sivir, who I, I believe she can block um, uh, at least his poke with her spell shield and regain some mana. So I guess right now, I'm guessing like bot might be stalemated in some way, since like both players can dodge other people's skills in some way and uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah Repel being able to just take at least off of being targetable at all and Sivir being able to spell shield the stun, I believe it's a stun actually, because I got hit by the other day and it said stunned, which stunned me because it does that, but also because I thought it was a snare, and I'm like, well, this is actually far worse than I expected. And um, then spiders everywhere, and it was bad for me. So you see both teams head off to the windmill right now. Someone's got that speed aura. Poppy's got that paragon. Diana doesn't have anything. She's slowly trotting up towards the top. On the opposite side, looks like Volley's... Infeed's Volley's gonna stop to get that tower. And Infeed playing Volibear's pretty cool. I hear good things about his Volibear. People have hyped it up, so... Uh, Maybe we'll see what he can do here. Any blind shot through the wall? Ooh, yeah, Diana able to connect a little bit of poke there. Something we start to see now, people shooting through that little orange stand. And uh, Riven's currently catching the top turret, and... Oh, and Vi with that. Uh, pick you. Stopping that capture. Oh, and Volibear with the wing, managing to um, get uh, Vi out of it. Oh, and Vi being exhausted. Riven on the brink of death, and she died. She managed to die from a Poppy's Q. Infeed running low on health and his passive has half to pop and Alpha Fear trying oh. to get the kill on by but is unfortunately gonna be stopped by uh, Poppy's Q, not yeah, being able to catch. I think it would have been better if he just tried to not die right there rather than chase yeah. um Vi as much as he did. But now we got the revive wave coming up to the top end of the map here. As you're gonna catch back up, it's gonna be a very lopsided fight. Never man thinking about recalling, but no, there's a health relic and you have plenty of mana. It's going to be okay. No, he's gonna recall anyway, even though he took the health relic. You're a jerk. Why would you do No, he's gonna stay. He faked me out again. He's that kind of guy. Well, um, currently Pierre for team trying to do something. It looks like Volley is trying to get a fling on someone, but Poppy is gonna charge in on Israel. Israel gonna miss that Q. Poppy on the verge of death right here. Uh, nice heal from Sona. Not sure if Poppy's gonna make it out alive, but currently, um, Israel and Riven are about to die also. And, um, yeah, unfortunately, no one dies. Oh, here. Fat Me getting bear flung. Just flinging up Fat Me, and Fat Me's probably going to die here, and yes, she is dead. Vi, hopefully, trying to clean up of the damage that Vully was able to do. And, uh, oh no, they managed to get away, but, uh, they at least get the kill on Israel, and it's alright, dude. Blue team. And they and I have defended the point by doing that, too, keeping the enemy down there in the jungle with um, the pressure by them pushing out, making that so they can't really recall or collect themselves and get health or anything like that. We're seeing recalls all the way across the board right now, and uh, Poppy went for a gank down the bottom lane, at least repelled up. Evansu get away really, really low on health, but Rise does catch Super Quack Duck there, and Evansu contributes from across the wall with the Boomerang Blade, but Super Quack Duck's move out of the way before anything can go on there. 
David's going to use this time to recall, and Poppy's still active on the enemy side of the map, so it'll be interesting to see what she does. That's the ballsiest recall ever, and it oh wasn't, was not meant to be. Gets caught by the stun right there. Tries to put some hurt on Alpha Ferret, but Poppy's a little bit durable, able to survive. Alpha Ferret, ooh, he doesn't have ooh, his so arcade good. shift right now, and he doesn't connect with the True Shot Barrage to get the kill. Oh, something um, slow there. Riven trying to get away now. Oh, and uh, nice ults from uh, Vi and uh, so on. Being able to pick up the kill on Riven right here. And if he's trying to do something about it right now, but he, the damage from Diana and so on is just way too much. He has to back down. And oh, Vi is being able to stop Vi from capturing. And Vi is going to, oh, actually engage on Rise. And is Vi going to try to exhaust and try to survive here? But Vi isn't going to be able to get the last hit on Rise. And Rise is just going to get that heal. Alright, has plenty of mana, but not a lot of health, so he plays it really safe. He can still contribute to a fight, despite being uh, uh, a little fragile right now. This is Netterer man. He, he, he hates minions so much. He wants to make a withdrawal from the United Bank of Minions there, and he's going to take a recall as well. Ferret and Silver Dragon on their way up to the top. Infeed, not terribly tanky yet. He's got Zerker's Greaves and Negatron Cloak, maybe going for sort of a more of a bruisery build than a straight tank build. We'll have to see as the game goes on. Arcane Shift gets Alpha Ferric out of the way of that, 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 that Crescent Strike that it's called. If you don't know what an ability is called, you can click the champion on the bottom left, you can mouse over stuff. It's pretty neat. They're pushing that creep wave up. You want to keep it off that tower. Minions are MVP. Many games we've seen turned around in the minutes. Infeed's going to go for the dive. Oh, and Volley's trying to fling Fat Me again here, here. but uh, Vi's getting stunned here. Poppy actually uses an ult on um, Rise. Rise is going to be taken down here by Vi, and Poppy's going to be able to take down uh, Riven right here. And uh, Volley Bear isn't going to be able to do much, and he's just going to back up from this. And Blue Team is just going to push out, but meanwhile, not a lot happening at Vi. And uh, Silver and at least are going to be like in a stalemate right now. But Silver trying to do something, missing that um, cocoon, but and she tries to land a Q, but Evanson's gonna not be, Evanson's gonna block that and regain some mana right here. I think later on the game, I think that Elisa's uh, repel to close the gap is gonna make it really difficult for Evansu when he gets into a position where he can get killed a little bit more easily because what do you spell shield? Do you spell shield the repel or do you spell shield the stun? And Nightwolf Hero! That's oh, not where you want to be. Getting completely destroyed right there. Sick opening crate up at the top because of that. And nice stun. Stun after uh, Diana does the pull there. All that crowd control. And Infeed was nowhere near for that fight, but he can't really contribute now because with Sona there and being a quick champion and Poppy as well being a quick champion, Volley doesn't really have any ability to start a fight with them because they can just get away. And Sona, in addition to that, can slow her power cord to make things really nasty. And now Evansu, let's see what he decides to spell shield. If anything, he's going to pop the ult and start running away, but he is slowed by painkiller Sona right there and not going to be able to escape. And we'll see if they make a play for this bottom lane right here. Ezreal is on his way down right now. Is he going to try and interrupt it manually, or is he going to go for the true shot barrage? I don't think he wants to waste it quite yet. Nope, he is going to go for the arcane shift in instead to keep that off of cooldown. Alright. And as we see, Israel is going to be holding well, but meanwhile on top, all of this in the action right there. Poppy managing to kill River. Isn't he trying to get the kill on Fat Me, but he barely but he isn't able to get the kill on Fat Me. And Poppy landing that perfect Q on Rise before Rise can do anything to uh, probably kill her. And Alpha Ferric didn't use his ult in that fight either, so he still has it for later. He didn't uh didn't contribute to that one, he was still down here in the bottom lane, holding things off a little bit. Now, oh, David's going for Alpha Ferret right there. A nice arcane shift puts Sivir right in the way, so David's not able to connect with Ezreal. Now Fatme's gonna join the fight, and that burst damage from Diana could be disastrous. We see the true shot barrage goes off. The spell shield's pretty nice right there. She goes in anyway, does the DPS, spider bomb coming out, up, oh, gonna kill some minions, oh. and that's about it. Yeah, oh, meanwhile, at, um, Oh, and Evasu just gonna get caught here by Fat Me. Fat Me is going to be able to take um, Al uh, Silver down here, and uh, Alpha Ferrix is gonna be able to kill Elise while at it. So Fat Me and uh, Israel here are just gonna duke it out. But meanwhile, at uh, mid, as you see, Vi is probably going to go down by uh, Riven. Infi is going to fling a uh, painkiller. Oh, right now it's a 2v1 situation right now for Bowie. Bowie is trying to get to do as much damage as he can to uh, 
uh, Sona, but it looks like Poppy is going to take down it, Infy here. With the Q seem to exhaust and slow him down. But Infy, it looks like Infy is just going to get away with his Q. And, oh no, Poppy lands the... Did you see that oh, speed gosh. boost come out from Painkiller right there? You oh, get Super man. Quack Duck, just that extra little bit of distance to close in and take down Volley. Very nice support play from Painkiller in that instance. Now Painkiller coming down to the bottom. Evan Sue, he's aware now, but he doesn't have anywhere to go. He eats the slow, and the Repel comes down, at least cleans that up. Oh, and uh, looks like Vi is going to engage on Rise here. No, she actually just backs away. Not a lot of action going on right now. Uh, oh, Sona getting caught right there by Israel and Riven. And Israel is trying to poke David down. And it looks like there's going to be two bot right now. Uh, Vi just waiting to catch. Looks like, oh, she's going to engage on a Rise right here. But looks like she can't do a lot of damage. Infi is just going to block, is just going to keep Vi away from it Rise right here. And meanwhile, Israel just re just dies to um, Elise there. And Elise getting a double kill. Nice play from those two. Uh, being able to, like, yeah, I guess, yeah. And uh, Ryze, Ryze is going to be here up top, taking the quest point for uh, Purple Team. And this looks like Purple Team is going to be able to use this to motivate them to possibly get a comeback. And Fatmi and Sona are just going to go into jungle and wait for um, someone. And oh, Poppy's actually just going to backdoor um, mid right and here. She actually did manage to get the entire tower. I didn't think she would be able to, but. She was kind of right on that while fights were breaking out elsewhere, and now they're going to defend that tower. They don't have top, but that's okay since right now they're in control of the drill. And oh, Poppy! See, I don't know, Poppy we haven't seen her in tournaments, but she is still disasterific if you get her in a game or have to play against her. So now that they've taken out a couple people, Evan Sue died in the bottom lane, David was able to get that kill down there, 1v1 against Sivir, and it looks like Sona and Poppy going up top to deal with rise, but in the bottom, it's going to be Diana getting interrupted by Ezreal, unfortunately. Does get the neutral off, however. Painkiller still chasing Nightwolf around, and uh-oh, Nightwolf, I'm scared of you. That's just one body slam away from disaster, and able to click the tower before it fires, saving Poppy in the process. And uh, meanwhile, mid, um, currently Vi is just all the way over. And uh, a cute, nice Q coming out from Femi, but Femi is going to be unable to do that. Okay. Femi is going to get exhausted, trying to kill um, Riven right here. And Vi is try currently trying to take down uh, Israel. Most likely she is. Oh, and nice from Vi. And oh, Fatmi's Vi able to get away. Yeah. Whoa, Fatmi almost dying right here. She she's going to go be Sona in a bad situation right now. She's probably going to get bursted down by Vi. Looks like no. It's Rise painkiller. He knows how to live low health. He'll be fine. Yeah. I'm more and worried about the tower, though. Mm -hmm. Purple team is going to be able to capture it. Oh, nice garrison Sona right there. Oh, but and an awesome oh, right there. Oh, dear. Oh, man. It looks like Israel is not going to be able to do much. And Israel is going to be down for the count right here, just by Poppy. Yeah. Looks like she's going to be able to get a double kill. Yes, nice exhaust from her and getting a double kill on her. Infi on the brink of death right here. His pop passive pop, is that going to be enough to save him? Most likely is. Uh, ooh, I nice slow from Infi. Barely and getting away there. Sona was not able to give them the speed they needed to catch up to him, and he's just going to run full tilt for his base. And that's why Painkiller is such a scary player to have to play against, because you saw how low he got on hit points, but he still hung around, contributed to the fight, threw down a garrison, threw down some heals, threw down some slows, a clutch stun, picked up assists like crazy, and helped turn that fight around, despite being at less than a quarter when that started. But now... Caught between a bear and a broken wings combo is not a good place to be. Painkiller does get taken down. Nether Man retreating up to the top. However, Diana is not too far behind. And he's... Is that the ballsiest recall ever? No, it's not going to be. Fami initiates in on Silver Dragon right there. Broken wings gets a little bit of airborne going on, but that only delays Riven's death a little bit there. Infeed's having a little bit of trouble right here against Vi. Vi's got that armor break, and it seems like Volibear, he just, his armor's not quite up to the task when it's broken. Uh, Kurang looks like for the score, it looks like he's going to be game right here. But if Purple Team can try, attempt to do something about top, if they still have enough time, but oh, it looks like Blue Team is probably going to cap um, Botter down here. Uh, is um, Sivir and Riven trying to go down there and stop it before anything goes wrong? But no, oh. Evan Suit just gets bursted down. But oh, and uh, looks like David, Evan don't just, stand oh, in that! 
Oh, the broken man. wings would have got, or the wind slash would have got him anyway, though. Well, that was a nice deny from Sibri, either he way. He did delay yeah. long enough for Painkiller to take the bomb tower, though, and with that secured, now I think that's the, uh, that's gonna be the, uh, the nail in the coffin, the, the, the hinge in the door, the, uh, screw that affixes your clock to your wall, whatever metaphor you want to use for the blue team to take this game. Yeah, it looks like it's a game for, um, Football team right here. Uh, ooh, and Diana trying to do something about it before trying to kill Israel before the game ends. But no, it looks like it's too late and it's over for Purple Team. Unfortunately, Blue Team is going to win this game. Some just awesome play from Super Quack Duck and Painkiller all game long. Uh, Evan Sue just not quite able to stand up to David One Two Five Nine Six is at least down there in the bottom lane. And in feed, he's he was the realest bear when he was alive. Yeah. That armor break um, really did him in a couple fights. Yeah. So, um, looks like on the scores right here, Israel and Riven not being able to have a great score. Same thing for Sivir. It looks like throughout the whole entire game, Rai, Sivir, and Israel, and Riven were just getting focused on every single fight. Bola Bear was, unfortunately, the only tank for them, and every time Blue Team saw an opportunity to uh, engage on the squishy targets for, um, 